Let's talk about this a little bit more. I wanted to make this clear. We did not, we did not course these people into saying anything, even though we did take a side. We clearly were on the black female side. And, and, and we're liberals. And we, you know, so we probably do, honestly, probably do always um, think of the minority as the person who might be the victim, right? We're guilty because we're humans and our, our political mindset does come into every equation, but it comes into yours too. So if you're watching this and you're on the other side, understand this. <laughs> Your political mindset comes with how you are as a human being. You know, Anderson Cooper, he works for CNN. His mindset is going to be affected by the way he tells the story. You can't incriminate that man for that. That's just who he is. And that goes for Bill O'Reilly too, right? Bill O'Reilly's on the other side. You can't help that man from having an opinion. He's a human being, a great human being who loves God. I'm sure both of them men love God. Look, and you are no person to doubt that, right? You are just a human being and you cannot doubt people's faith, right? And their integrity. I'm sure Bill O'Reilly wants to get a good story. I'm sure he's entertainment, right? We are entertainment too. That's why we put it in our name. But we are fool. We are fool. We tell, we try to tell the best we story we can tell. I mean, we really do. I mean, we we might fuck up. We might come short, right? We we try to tell every fucking story that we possibly can. But we we bound to fuck up every now and then. We we bound to screw up. I'm gonna go down back down country club and head on over there to where we were going, because I don't know why I turned around and you just let me do it. <laughs> But um, driving, not me. <laughs> so um, we are bound. We're bound to tell. We're bound to screw up. But hey, look, if you why don't you go back down that way? Because it's shorter to get back. We have made almost a full circle now, so it's shorter to get over there where we're headed. Um, by just going this way. So you're gonna make another U-turn? Yeah, I'm gonna make a U-turn. I shouldn't have made that last one, <laughs> but I got caught up in talking to this camera. But, you know, it, it's it's crazy that people think that, that, that Fox News shouldn't have an opinion or that MSNBC shouldn't have an opinion or that CNN shouldn't have an opinion. I think what's wrong is that CNN says, oh man, stuffed up. Ew. CNN says that they're the most trusted name in news. Now, how the fuck do you know if you are the most trusted name in news? news right there's probably i try i like cnn i do but i'm a liberal so and that tends to be liberal right they say it's more liberal i like cnn but you don't know the guy that's a <laughs> donald trump supporter the guy that's on the far right he don't think you're the most trusted name in news so you 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 you're doing your own self a disservice by because he hears that and he goes that's a lie you're not the most trusted name in news Right? I would like to believe that Full Entertainment Media is the most trusted name in news. But I don't believe that because I ain't crazy. <laughs> well, I might be crazy. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know about you not being crazy. But, uh, Just a little bit. <laughs> but, you know, but we understand we're entertainment, right? That's why we put it in our name. And Fox News is crazy if they don't think they're entertainment. And CNN is crazy if they don't think they're entertainment. And that's crazy. And NPR, I don't give a fuck what news outlet. You're talking to a fucking camera. You come across the television set. You come across the YouTube screen. You are entertainment. The fuck what you heard. The fuck what you heard. You are entertainment, right? We know we're entertainment. That's why we put it in our name. But they know they entertainment too. But they like the word news. Hey, look, we, this is news. We're news. This is the... We doing a lot more hard work than they doing. We don't got no fucking... 50 million secretaries lined up across the fucking table, you know? We 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 work with a skeleton crew. Now, we doing better than most. We doing better than most, but it's because we work. We put in work. We we risk getting tickets so we can get a little story, you know? We, we work hard for what we do, right? And it's hard doing it. It's really hard doing it. Police think we're the bad guy. We're not the bad guy. We love the police. Do you hear me? I love the police. I really do. I know it don't come across that way all the time. But flip the camera because the opportunities are everywhere to tell a story. Record this cop right here. What is he doing? 
all he's doing now he just pulls out he just pulled out and all he's doing is riding around looking for somebody to pull over for speeding why isn't this man solving a crime and there's 101 people probably on Piney Green Road I, I made that number up but there's a lot of people on this very road that probably have a bicycle stole look that's a poor area over there you see that he could ride over there and just ask people, how are you doing? They call it friendly door knocks, and I, some people don't like that. Do something, but we, what we know, that's the stop right there, record that. That's where we were that a couple nights ago, we recorded the police right there, and I had a friendly conversation with the cops. We're not anti-police. <laughs> now some people that do cop block videos, I don't even think of us as doing cop block videos. I use that term because it's widely accepted, right? Because we do do that we but we are too, we are full entertainment media that's what we are we tell any kind of story i told you from the get-go this is about what goes on in my brain i've thought this for years this is we have a philosophy go ahead and finish the sentence we have a philosophy of what you gonna leave me hanging really i'm lost we have a philosophy of common sense you never heard me say that? No. You damn lie. You never said that. No, I say it to all me. the time. I say it you all the time. You've never said that. That's I've why never it's real. You, you know what? That. We're not going to edit this moment out, right? Because we want you to see how real what we do is. But we have a philosophy of common sense, right? This is just common sense. Now, I could choose to edit this out and say that was an epic fail, but that is. Uh that's just the truth you know people do fail people do come up short and we're not perfect and we don't like to put the glitz and the glamour on it, right we, we don't we want you to see that we're real we're real real people you know what happened in between that woman and that other woman the black woman and the white woman that's how we'll tell this story it's just true it's just plays out in our country over and over it's why obama won an election but let's not kid ourselves. It's why Donald Trump won an election. It's not, that story is as simple as why the we've had our last two presidents, right? It really is. <coughs> Obama, like, what did, what did Bo Burnham, we're getting in the time machine, at the YouTube Live, Bo Burnham said, let's not kid ourselves, Obama won because of the black vote, right? Let's not kid ourselves. Now, he said it as a joke, but why is it funny? Because Chris Rock said it's funny because it's true. <laughs> you know? And it is. And then why why did Donald Trump win? Because racist white people voted for him. It's just the truth, folks. And the Bible teaches us that the truth shall set you free. Log out.